Hello, Rostify team, and uh, welcome to Momentum 7. And this is week 29, if you can believe it, 29. And uh, different surroundings today. We're in the audio studio, podcast studio at the, the Commons in Collingwood. Hopefully the sound quality today is is excellent and you can hear me run through these seven things because there has been, well, more than seven things, yet um, let me share these with you. So number one this week, uh, the release notes video from July the 6th. Nathan, cracking work. Love your work there. Uh, very impressive, very useful. Keep it going. Excellent quality. Um, number two this week was Philip. Philip making his webinar debut with Team London and Hockey England. So being part of a, a collective group there and that content now back with us and, and, and able to share the Rostify platform. So great effort on getting ourselves out there as broadly as possible. Um, number three this week, Momentum 7, was the Rugby League World Cup tender pitch. So that's now in, in motion. Uh, it's a joint pitch by ourselves with a credit. And it's, it's, we're in the mix, we're in the final couple. I was able to sit in the background and listen to Phil do some excellent work there, supported by Nathan, along with our partners at Accredit. So uh, decision due late July, hopefully all wrapped up by the end of August. So uh, rapid, uh, rapid, there we go. Short sort of turnaround expected there. Um, number four this week is, yeah, a, a lot have been introduced to the business case framework exercise. And we're going to put that in place for two projects, being the, the fundraising project and the uh, attendance tracker project. And that's really to bring all things together and make sure we get the maximum value out of these collaborations and communicate it properly across our team. So thank you for accepting the logic around that. And, and, and um, the results will be shared from that fairly shortly. Uh, number five this week. So preparation has started around an engagement survey to gain feedback on ourselves. So Recently, as part of the, the culture strategy sessions with the, the founders and management was um, some peer feed, feedback and, and, and reflecting. The next stage is to bring that across broader to our team overall. And the information, the results from that will be shared. It's anonymous. So um, feel free, go, go your hardest. Yet you'll start to see some the final survey go out very shortly and the information will be presented back at um, our August gathering. Number six this week. And is it the Q2 reviews? So they're well and truly underway. We're two thirds of the way down. Always enjoy um, the experience personally. And thank you for being you know, so open and honest and, 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 and really, really so much inspiring stuff comes out of these. Um, if I look at it now, it's probably it's our third sort of form. So our performance review back in January, uh, the reflect and reset during April, and now the Q2 review. So everybody in our team has had three of these sort of checkpoints to go through and it's really building some excellent, excellent IP. So thanks for being part of that. Bloody grateful for what you give to me. Um, number seven, language warning. If you have small children, block their ears now. I'm just going to get emotional over this, but um, you know, we, we really wanted to try and achieve a position where everybody could come back to work uh, full time and we're very, very close to that. So Dom and Phil, um, as of next week, are, are back full time uh, with, with the team. So you know, we wanted to achieve that position of financial stability that we can do do that long term. It's now looking much, much better on that side of things. However, having said that, um, so happy that this is now able to occur, yet the expectation is that we're going to keep growing and, and the commercial return will make that situation better for all of us. So, you know, good week on week 29. Thanks for all your help. Keep it going. Have a safe weekend and take care. Be good.